Good morning, besties. Hello, how are you doing? I hope you are well. Do you want to say hello? Hello. Hi. As I was saying, hello and welcome back to my channel. If you do not know, my name is Holly. Uh, why are all the animals going crazy today? I've got no idea what I've got even in my cupboard, so I don't know why I'm choosing to film this today. I was just like, you know what? I kind of fancy filming what I eat in a day, and cause I don't know why I keep watching everyone else's on TikTok, so I'm gonna do it on YouTube. So yeah, today's video is a what I eat in a day, obviously vegan edition. So I'm gonna start with breakfast, obviously. First things first, okay, always. Do you want food? Tell me what do you start with? Do I have a camera what you have first? Yes. Food. You're right. First things first, big fat pint of water. Important. Cheers. <sighs> water. Mwah. All that water's gone straight to my head. Now I'm going to make, obviously, a cup of tea. Although you can see me. Tea time. This breakfast, okay, has come from nowhere, but I am obsessed with it. Obsessed. I I've got a slight issue. For my breakfast, I need milk in my tea and my cereal, and it turns out I've got no milk. Am I gonna have to go and get some milk? It appears so. Let's go get some milk. BRB. I'm back. So I've got like a local bakery. I'm not going to show you what the bakery is because I don't know where I live. But I have like a local bakery and sometimes I do these accident accidentally vegan chocolate croissants. So I've got them for later. Can't wait for that. Back to the brekkie fast. Obviously a tea. And then my new obsession, the Weetabix. Oh my gosh, it's all I have right now. All I have. I always have three Weetabix. Is that a lot of Weetabix actually? Let me know. Like how many Weetabix is like the, the normal amount of Weetabix? Because I personally always have the three and I go from there. Get your oat milk or whatever milk you want. And then pour. Okay, and now this is where I'm a really bad vegan. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna own up to it. I'm gonna be honest. If you wanna cancel me, it's fine. I, I know it's wrong, I know I claim to be vegan. I know, I know it all. Don't have a go at me, okay? I'm trying my best. The thing I put on my Weetabix now is pure Welsh honey. I mean, any honey will do. I normally have Manuka honey. This is one that I've just grabbed, so that. I grab a spoon, I just dip the spoon in. Okay, so there's honey on the spoon. I've just flicked it everywhere. Oopsie. And then I just smash the Weetabix together. And the honey kind of goes into the Weetabix and it all just comes together like a porridge kind of look. It's literally my go-to. I'll show you how I make my tea, but I think you've seen it a hundred times by now. So this is how it looks. It's a very beige breakfast. But I am personally okay with that. It's so easy, so simple. I'm like, sometimes I put banana in it or blueberries or whatever, but to be honest, I just can't bother to. I have this weird thing though. I mean, my friend always talk about this. If we have Weetabix or cereal or porridge or something for breakfast, and this isn't very healthy, I don't think, so don't like listen to me on this. But if we have a breakfast which doesn't involve bread, we feel okay to have bread for lunch. Because me and my friend love bread. Bread obsessed, like sandwiches, toast, all the bread options you've got. We love. I kind of got obsessed with having Weetabix. It means I'm allowed to have toast or bread or something like that for lunch. I'm gonna eat this now and then I'll catch up with you when I have a snack. That was a solid 10 out of 10. I'm now going to go take my cup of tea and do some editing for a little bit, and then I'll catch up with you when I've got a snack. How we bloody doing, me lads? Hey, how we doing? Hey, angel face, how are you? It's a little more late now. It's now five past 10. Are you okay? Can I help you? You ain't getting none of that, sir. Mm -mm. Oh yeah, sure, please join us. Please come on in. Please, feel free. Oh. So, it's now like 10 o'clock kind of thing. So I've now got a pint of water. Water's important. I've also got a little croissant. It smells amazing. It smells like I'm on holiday. I can't even lie. And then I've also got a cup of tea. Obviously, me loves. Let's try this croissant, shall we? 
What the heck? That is amazing. Oh, there's a fly. Oh, oh, it's hot. <gasps> the Kardashians come out today. <coughs> Watching the Kardashians if you come to death. I feel like I need something healthy after this, I can't lie. I love you. When you sit and watch what I eat a day, do people think that's all you eat every day, all day? Because obviously you don't. Well, I don't anyway. <coughs> oh, goodness me. I'll see you at the next food time. Another meal, another few hours later, still no shower. It's now 25 to 1. And a bit peckish. So I'm really stuck between having beans on toast or like a BLT kind of vibe. However, I don't have any lettuce. So it's going really well. Why do you want to eat every time I'm eating? Let me know. Honestly, she's been asleep all day. I put down the food, here she is. Meow, meow, meow. I want food. Meow, meow, meow. Can you use spinach instead of lettuce? Because I'm either going to have avocado beans on toast or avocado attempt of BLS. I love beans on toast. I really do, but I feel like it's quite boring. I imagine what I eat in a day, beans on toast. But then also BLT. Like, I'm not having anything exciting. Oh, there's so much pressure being a YouTuber. I'm going to have the BLT. That spinach smells weird. Real, real, real. So I've got my avocado, my tomato. I've got this Tesco multi-seeded batch loaf, which I'm gonna toast. Oh my gosh, I forgot. I have this, which is a vegan pucker sausage roll. These are so good. Are they high in protein? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, but oh, I'm gonna have that as well later. But I've got this Asda, which Asda, we never ever go to Asda, so I don't know why we've got this, but hey. We've got this meat-free bacon style rasher, so I'm gonna quickly fry that, toast some toast, and make an attempt of a BLT. So whilst the bacon is cooking momentarily behind me, what? Get a knife, but be safe. Score said avocado, score it, so it's like this. Get yourself a bowl, and I just, I don't squeeze it out, I don't, I don't know why I'm about to pretend that I do that. I never do that. Get a fork, and just scoop it out into the bowl, and then you just mash it. I used to actually show avocado on here all the time. I've actually had avocado in yonks, to be honest. Oh, the toast is burning, toast is burning, toast is burning, toast is burning, toast is burning. Toast is burning. Toast is burning. Toast is burning. The toast? is a damn. So now I'm getting a uh, the vegan Philadelphia and just grab whatever's left and spread it on said bread. We've got Philadelphia on this side. Here we want the other. No avo gets left behind. Am I right? Which I don't love this idea, but I have no lettuce. We have the spinach. And then add your bacon. Tomato, nothing. What's tomato with you? Yeah. <laughs> and that is a BLT. And this is lunch. We have a vegan sausage roll, a vegan BLT, a banana, and a protein trek bar. Lunch. Oh, and of course, a cup of tea. Oh, and I left my water. Oh, well. Very fulfilling. It's very full. To everything I would desire. Okay, so now I'm gonna put on some YouTube. I don't know what though, because I'm currently very up to date with YouTube. Sorry about that, Zoella has posted a 44 minute YouTube video. So I'm gonna sit and watch that. You know, I, when I'm home alone or if I'm eating alone, I'll always watch something, whether it's Vampire Diaries or YouTube, I'll just stick it on and watch it. And as soon as I'm done, I'll pause it and I'll come back to it when I'm eating again. That's what I'm doing. So I will see you when it's done. So the camera stopped recording, which was high key rude. Like, ugh. you need to relax yourself. So I've just finished my BLT, 10 10, like I say. You know what? You know, just, the BLT has also become a staple for me a lot of the time now. I had a BLT actually in Liverpool and it started a craze for me. Like, I am obsessed with a BLT, a vegan one. If they're on the menu, 
I am getting it. Now I'm gonna have this Trek bar. I actually got these today from, I think, Tesco, and it's Trek Protein Flapjack Cacao Oat. It's got nine grams of protein in it. I don't know if that's a lot, but I am trying to eat a bit more protein at the moment. I really wonder, these have the videos, I'd love to know. Do I eat similar to you? Do I eat dissimilar? Do I eat weird? Do I eat old? Like, I used to be a snacker, a grazer. Now, I wouldn't have meals. I would just have snack, 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 toast, snack, cereal, dinner. I've really tried it into a routine of having a breakfast, a lunch, a dinner, and having like small snack in between, kind of thing, like through a croissant as it was this morning. I'm actually getting quite full now. So I'm gonna finish this, have a banana, and I'm gonna save this off the droll for when I'm watching the new Kardashians, which I'm so excited for. I'll catch up with you when I'm keeping up with the Kardashian. It's not called that anymore, for God's sake. Ah, hello there. So this is where I am now. I will be here now for the next half hour, hour, watching the Kardashians. 20, 25 to one. And I'm about to have my pucker pie. No, pucker sausage roll. Before it starts, I'm gonna try the sausage roll with you guys. Not try it, I know what it's like, but this is it. Didn't know. This is so my kind of food. This crisp sandwiches, bread, all of that is my kind of food. Like, give me this over a chocolate bar any day. But yeah. Mmm. I'm gonna go and watch the Kardashians now. And here we are with the next meal of the day. Obviously, it, I don't know if you can see, you kind of can, it is currently chucking it down. That's dramatic. Oh, that's fair, I'm under a tree, so half it's not getting me, to be fair. But it is wet, it is cold. I have showered, but I haven't dried my hair. I'm going straight to my brother's barber with wet hair and a hat on, so he's gonna hate me for that, but pumpkin spice. I was about to look for my phone then, you bet. I'm currently filming on my phone because I forgot my camera. Love that. Oh, also, I was in Starbucks. Obviously, I've not got my glasses on and my eyesight is categorically the worst eyesight I think I've ever had in my life. It's the only eyesight I've ever had, so that makes sense. Yeah, and I was literally like, wait, is that my friend over there? Like, it looked like, like she was like identical to my friend. And I was literally like, is that, is that you? And like, hello, is that you? Um, and I was staring like a bloody creep at this poor girl as she was kind of like, why is this fruit staring at me? It wasn't her. Of course it wasn't. Of course it wasn't her. Who like of course it wasn't her. Like, why would I be so stupid to actually think it was? Anyway, I'm gonna get my hair cut now because I'm actually five minutes late. But when I was turn up with this, hopefully, hopefully he'll understand why. I doubt it, but hey. You might be able to work out that this is not the same day. My apologies. My very much bad. The last clip I filmed I was having a pumpkin spice last night I went to get my hair cut and then I got like this chronic headache and I literally came home and just slept. I didn't have food, I just slept. So you haven't missed anything, well you have actually, you've missed today's food. But I thought I'd finish it with today's dinner, which I'm about to make now. I'm balancing you on like a parcel, like a big parcel. I think I'm gonna have this, it's what the clog the vegetarian butcher likes. It's like basically vegan chicken pieces, like that. I'm also obsessed with this like potato dish. So I'm gonna do that. It's like a cubed potato, honey, chili, garlic dish. It's really, really good. It's really, really quick recipe to make. You'll literally fry the chicken, cut the rice, boil potatoes for five minutes, fry them, and then fry them with honey and whatever seasoning you want. So I'm gonna quickly rustle that up and then I'll show it you. But yeah. So I'm the potatoes are currently cooking. I probably should show you them. I've just been to the post office and dropped off a load of Depop parcels. But if you don't know, I now sell on Depop. Deep pop, a, a, a. Not an ad. I'm so excited. This meal is genuinely one of my favorite meals I've ever had. It's so simple, so easy, so basic. So delicious. So that is like um, potato and tomato, and that is the chicken. And then this is the rice I'm using. I think it's just like an Aldi rice ready in two minutes. Really quick, really easy. This is the dinner. It doesn't look very appetizing at all, but genuinely, when I add this to it as well, this is the Blue Dragon Sweet, chili sauce, it's amazing. So that's for chicken, that's for rice, obviously, and that is tomatoes and potatoes. I like honey, chili, garlic, potatoes. And I just like drizzle this sauce on my rice. So good, I can't even express how good it is. Like, doesn't look it, but I swear it is. The thing about it, all these flavors combined, and then occasionally you get a bit of like the burnt garlic and wham. Burnt garlic, wow, so good. Mmm. If I had broccoli in, I would have added broccoli to the potatoes, but I didn't. But, so good. I'm gonna sit here now, 
Finish this off, enjoy it, and then wash up because I need to do that. But I feel that's the last thing I'm going to eat today. I think I might have a cup of tea or something later, but I think this might be the last thing. If I have anything else, I will insert it and show you guys. But that's typically what I eat in a day. Obviously, it changes every day, and normally I eat with my family and stuff, but this week they've been out, I've been out. It's been very busy. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like button, and I will see you very soon with another video. Thank you.